Oh, that was the idea I was thinking of. Oops, almost just stabbed myself. <laughs> this, oh man, this place is an absolute pigsty. Uh, so let's get it going. Okay, after second thoughts from that shot, I switched the color. All right, you stinky cherub. I, I've got so many things that I really need to just catch up on. I didn't, I thought, let's not do a vlog today because of the side quest I wanted to do. I don't have time to do that. I've got to prioritize other things. So today, um, we're gonna make, let's just start doing it, shall we? <laughs> Number one, tidy office. Just give me a minute. Okay, so we've got our, not really ideas, the things that we have to do. Now, you see over here, up here, this is my system. This is one of my systems to be able to accomplish the things that I want to accomplish. So it, this also bloody illustrates another problem, isn't it, with me? Oh my gosh, I'm so broken. That's actually done. Okay, you have three main tasks to be completed in the day. Well, I have three main tasks. You have your top priority, medium, lowest priority, but they're still your top three priorities of the day. I like this system, it works well, but on a day like today where I have so many small things to do and some big things, then, oh, that was the idea I was thinking of. Oops, almost just stabbed myself. I have a fat stack of things to do. The, the, the trouble is, I know this is a waste of material. Like I could easily have just written those down on a whiteboard. I could put them in a note. But the way my mind works, I find it so much easier to have like a physical or tangible thing. And one of the reasons why I put this over here instead of right next to my desk is because I want to be able to finish the task, get up, physically move, pull it off and be like, yeah, good boy, you've done. Another reason why I put my candy, my DIY candy dispenser over here instead of next to my desk is because I should have to get up and physically move if I want to go and get a, a sweet. That's like my small uh, reason for telling myself you shouldn't have one. But then honestly, all bloody weekend, I kept going down and eating the Mike and Ikes that were from that one shot. So I'm gonna leave this out for today because I know there are gonna be more things I need to accomplish. And let's start with the ant farm. I should give these dickheads some more liquid, some more water. This one's almost dried up. No, get back in. This is Oliver, like a minute from now. I'm gonna show you this whole clip just of how difficult it was with these flipping ants because I have no idea what I'm doing. Hey! No! No! How'd you get straight back out again? Dude, these things have massive claws. Sh like sharp. Okay. Oh, there you are. That is my drinking water. I don't want to do that. So I didn't realize that you're meant to get very specific ants for an ant farm which I did for this, but I thought ants were ants. I used the fruit snack this time, but this time we're gonna go for a Sour Patch Kid. I'll eat the rest. And then. That was a little more successful. If I'm honest with you, I don't even know why I still have this because I do not care. I don't know what I'm doing and I don't have a plan for them. Get, I'm literally about to decapitate you. Get in, I'm just gonna decapitate you. I don't mess around, mate. So I put out a video on TikTok. I was like, what, do you, what is your thought on ants? Like, is it inhumane to mess with them? And I think they have this hive mind. And so the general consensus is that they don't, they're not like a dog type of animal. You can just do whatever you want with them. I'm taking that. All right. Enjoy your Sour Patch Kid.
you can't see anything about it. He's still moving, but it's just his head. As much as this one was being an ass and I'm fine with chopping his head off, I didn't enjoy it. So that takes me out of serial killer area, territory. Which means ant farm. Done. All right, now that this place is nice and tidy, like as tidy as enough as I'm happy with, autofocus is better. I started looking at what is the next priority. I've also had a few ideas as I've kept going. These three are done. That's good. We've only got 12 more to do. But here's my kind of thinking for this. These five are pitches to brands. Now the thing is, what I find really difficult about this is I could do the work now, send a video, send the email, and I probably won't hear back for a week or I have to do quite a few follow-ups. And I look at this and I think, oh, okay, yeah, I can put that off because I won't get anything from it. I want something that's immediately gonna give me, not necessarily satisfaction, but make me feel like I've completed something. But these are the ones with the most amount of lead time. So I think I'm gonna do those next. I'll just quickly tell you. I pitch brands with a video with my pitch, which is more just kind of sharing of what I can offer and how I can help them based on what they've been doing. It's pretty quick, simple and easy to do, but I found it's much more effective than sending an email. So I can get those done. And then all of this can be done in here. I need to run today and a flipping dentist appointment. Let's just call on that now. I get really annoyed. I've got a crown that seems to have loosened. I get really annoyed when you pay for a service and the service isn't done the way you expect it to be done or like something goes wrong with it. Cause not only have I spent money, I've also spent my time to get that done. Got something really cool tomorrow though. Okay, three o'clock. All right, I'll be there. Thank you very much. That is three hours from now. So dentist appointment. I'm gonna call that checked off because I know that has to be done. Oh. Siri, add a calendar event for dentist at 3 p.m. And I need to run before that. Sure, I'm not stinky. A TikTok I made for Sporting KC. I need their opinion on the script first. Script, the idea. Let's get that sent off and then. There are so many other ways I can think of prioritizing these, but for your sanity's sake and your time's sake, I'll save those for another video. <laughs> we're gonna send the concept off and then we we'll go for a run. All right, so it's just gone midday. It feels like 105 degrees. See how this goes. Forgot my headphones. <laughs> Good start. Oh, that's so good. I have no idea what I said before I went to go run. It feels like 105 degrees outside. That was only like two, three miles. Uh, I am in a disgusting space. So it is currently 1.20 and we'll see how long it takes me to stop sweating. In the meantime, we can cross this one off and send the TikTok idea to Sporting KC to approve. And then hopefully I can shower before the flipping dentist. my different cards of what I have left to do so I could do the next bit here and also I was like let's do a cool time lapse of the sun not the sun of the clouds to show the weather change or to show time passing there are no clouds I'm standing here trying to think do I walk my way in or do I oh, fuck it <laughs> I hate waiting around. So I was waiting in there for like 35 minutes for the person to come out to sort my teeth out. That's super annoying. Okay, once again, it's been a day of me picking out much more than I can chew off. So we have a lot left over, but we have a lot of things that we got completed and I got the rest of the O'Keefe's Healthy Feet short form video, the paid partnership that we had. That's up and done. That's great news, we like that. So I think tomorrow I have an event about 10 o'clock, which I'm really excited for. I'm not gonna hold you in suspense, so Oliver just flip in, say it, what is it? I'm gonna go watch the Sporting KC team train, which isn't something I would normally go and choose to do, but I get to make a video out of it. And that's like a good excuse to be able to go and kind of see what happens. I've never been to a professional training before, so I'm excited. Side note, from the running earlier, I put Celtic salt on my tongue, let it dissolve. This is for, like hydration, so making sure that every, all the rest of the water that I drink stays in my body, and doesn't just get flushed straight through so that I'm not dehydrated. Good girl, Duda. So we're gonna get our pitches done 
first thing tomorrow. I don't know if I'm just dragging this on, but I had a pretty rough start to the morning this morning. The kids were up super early, so where I would normally go to the gym, work out, and get some bits edited, I wasn't able to. Obviously, kids' family takes priority, so good to get that done. Now it's time to go spend time with the family. Goodbye.